one of the uh, main part in uh, in the editor job is to to have um, an objective point of view on the material that you have to work with. Um, to explain this, uh, imagine you are on the set. You are on the set. You see the the shooting of one shot, a very complicated shot with a crane, uh, with a big of move big movements, a lot, of, um, a lot of people in the frame, and it's really tough to get what the director wants. You know, it takes hours and it's complicated. You might have uh, a nervous breakdown of uh, someone and, and you'll have very painful memories of this shot. And at the end of the day, when, when you finally get it, the director will you know, stick to this shot because it was, it was so tough to get. You know. And uh, if you were there, you will get the same subjective point of view of the, of the shot. As if you just discover it in the cutting room, then you'll see a nice crane shot, but you, you won't know that it was so complicated to get. So then the shot doesn't have the same importance. You can quite easily not take it, take it out, or take just a small part of it. But if you were on the set, then you have the same view as the director has, on subjective view on this shot and you try to keep it. And that's not for the good of the film, sometimes. So it's very good to be the first spectator of the film, the first audience. And it's very important when you see um, the first time the rushes, to, to, to try to stick to the first feeling you had when you saw the, the elements. I mean, if you really liked one setup, or one shot, or one reaction, or one line set by an actor, then it's very good to try to remember this feeling you had. Because, of course, after that you're going to see the same shot hundreds of times. And then you tend to f you know, see other things in the shots and forget about the first impression you had. But the audience will have the first audience you had, the first impression you had. So it's very important to try to get them to stick to the memory of the first time you saw things with a fresh eye. And the fresh eye is one what what I think is the most complicated uh, thing to get on the course of, uh, of the... I'm not sure you can find trust. I think you can feel trust. I mean, you know, it's... Um, you have to be... It, it's, it's, um, it's a real journey you're doing in the cutting room. It's like being on a boat and crossing the ocean. You know, you're left alone by yourself with, uh, with another person and you have, to, uh, you have to drive this boat to... Um, to the goal you you want to reach, so um, so you have to be very honest. I think honesty is and, and truth and truth is the uh, the element. You you shouldn't lie to your to a director. You shouldn't lie to you. I mean, it's it applies to both. Uh, always say what you think. The uh, the only thing is to uh, try to uh, understand when you can say things and when it's not the right moment. You know, you have to. Uh, Try to, to, to know your director or your editor, if you're a director. So, um, so it's just a question of being uh, a normal human being, respecting the other one and um, working the same direction. I think it's nothing more. It's just it should be like this in normal life.